Good evening everyone, I'm Mark Harris, and welcome back to the wrong room. I was not clicked into the game. I am dumb. I don't know if anything was actually working to... Yay for Scuff! <laughs> we're underground in Sector 7. Uh, we're climbing another damn ladder. Um, it looks like there's security going on here. Uh, did we get... Can we still get a sass on? Yeah. Cool. I don't think any of these have uh, ability to learn, so. God damn, this thing is too fast. Oh, come on, you're an asshole. Okay, let's assess the cutter. Okay, she's gonna have a better chance of it. Because she's better evasively. She moves around more. Alright, let's go with... It's precious, let's stagger it. You got Cactor, and you got Carbuncle. That looks like we need Carbuncle right now. Physical damage. Ruby light will do. This is a physical enemy anyway. Ah, damn it, got her. Luckily, we're resistant. Right, this gives Ballot Barrett some moves. Yeah, we're waiting for Ruby. Okay, it heals us. Nice. And it's destroyed. Down it goes. Carbuncle worked out well. Reduced the damage we took and uh, increased the. Uh... Wow. That, that was what it did. Healed us at the end of its uh, thing, which is good. Hey, you think Wedge is holding up okay? Of course he is. He's a lot tougher than people think. Probably sleeping soundly, dreaming about his guests. You're right. We Probably. should treat him to a nice meal when he gets back. His choice. Right. 
I don't think those are the only two enemies we'll have. Oh look, we can see him lying on the floor. That way. No, let me hit the other. Oh, it's dead. Dead. Okay, down to one enemy. <laughs> and he's on the floor. Now he's staggered. Wow, that maximum fury thing is so powerful. Oh, right. Yeah, we should probably potion up Barrett a bit. I'm nearly, they're nearly gone. They're nearly gone. Not many of them left. Potions are really handy outside of battle, but inside battle, they're kind of worthless. Oh yeah, we can run. I forgot there's a run button. I keep forgetting there's a run button. Oh, this should be an easy fight. And we just maximum fury whatever's left. And they're all down. That's a win. How many proficiency bonuses would we have gotten from that with a number of deaths? Get the proficiency bonus from defeating stuff. Oh. Oh, I know where we are. Oh, well, we get the main fever Final Fantasy 7. Jazz version. I can't increment it with my mouse, really? But I can move up and down with, in anything else with the mouse. Okay. That's kind of weird programming. Not gonna lie, that's kind of weird. Alright, now we can all heal. Even though we healed already. All right, if I recall, this fight is an interesting one. We're also outside of the main story for the uh, other games, for the previous game, the original. Yeah, we're outside of the original's uh, storyline at the moment. Currently, we are doing an extra thing. None of this happens in the original. Hey, don't go back to check on anything, remember? Because it's all unique. Kind of padding a bit. He's okay. You sure? Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, making me worry like that. I kicked your ass if you didn't look like shit. Maybe he fell down here while looking for survivors. Or if he just fell down here when the plate fell. Okay, let's go. Yep, it's you, all right. <laughs> Fix him up. Wait. What is this? Barret! Why'd you run back in? If you both ran out, they wouldn't get to you. You've been out of there. If it left with you, you wouldn't have had to fight these things at all. There's a lot of them. Now you get a different target, one that can actually hit.
Ooh, Star Shadow's gonna hit a lot of them. Try to dodge. Ah, got them both. I think I defeated them both with that attack. Oh god damn it, Barrett! You're just shooting the wrong freaking one. John, snipe us if you're dead. That was great covering, Barrett. Okay, that's better cover. That's much better cover. Oh no! Big boss in front, behind. Big boss behind. Smaller guys in front. Star shower, there's so many of them. Oh, that's going on. I broke his appendage. I just throw another appendage. Ah oh, no, I think it went into a second phase. All right, Tifa and Barrett are both on the floor now. All this left is to deal with the Barrett can't really dodge. That's the problem. Too many of them. Barrett, I need you to cure on us. Gonna be many enemies around us, so let's do that and switch to Barrett. No, oh, attack this thing. Hey, it's a temp appendage is gone. Ah, uh, it's focus strike. to his
Is he asleep? No, it didn't get away. Also, Barrett, shouldn't you be like curagging? Oh, you got curaga now. That thing's asleep. Ah, damn it. Got him. You got Mithril Claws out of that. Got a T for upgrade. Cloud just comes in. You're up. Late to the party and you giving me orders? That is a shot and a half. Ah, that was a chance fight. If you'd say the same if I hadn't shot everything. And again, I had to break those things to get out of the way, like... Wait, Cloud's not even in the party yet? What the hell? <laughs> what? <laughs> that makes no sense. Okay, so we, we got just got Tifa a weapon. Ephra Claws, which is nice. It's actually a magic-based one, so it's a little bit less... But yeah, he's got she's got she trap. 
which uh, can be useful. It sets up a little trap on the field. For enemies that run around, it, it can be a good way to catch them. Of course, unlock them up to everything else. You notice it is very magic. Very magic focused, so we'll focus on that as well. I'll also give an attack power boost because it kind of needs the extra power. Uh, elemental defense. Concentration action, 30%. Keep off resistance. That sounds nice. Actually, elemental defense is good. That just raises all my defenses. And then a debuff resistance on top. Reduce the MP of spells. Increase chi level. I like that. Especially since she's using chi as her main main thing. So now we'll equip her with that. Gotta it's gonna really drop her attack though. Alright, should I put warding on cloud or something? I think I should. Warding and poison on cloud. Oh no, he, he has elemental, doesn't he? Oh wait, no. he has got elemental right now. Um, actually, I think this should be that. Oh, we didn't scan that enemy! I didn't even think to scan those enemies. I just thought I already had scanned them. I'm dumb. Okay. Also, I'm pretty sure we won't have another battle yet, so... It's fine. Wait, first, before we do that... Alright, stop walking. Oh, no, they won't let us. They won't let us go anywhere in here. You have to look out there. Oh yeah, we're going in. We're looking into this place. Oh God, were those people? Yeah, that's the Shinra I know. Uh, cloud, is that what you're not telling us? Cloud? Oh, here they come again. We're not supposed to be here. There come the ghosts again. You're not supposed to be here. You're not supposed to see this. How dare you change history? <laughs> we need to get him somewhere safe. Everything else can wait until after. Agreed. Let's go. Baron only put him on the other side of that barrier. That means the ghost must have carried him up here. Cloud. Huh. Good kitty. Yep, yeah, we're still playing as Barrett. 
Not entirely sure why, but let's go. Oh, wangly flangly flangly his arms. <laughs> That's not Bill right. That's not right. Did he lose his bones too? Oh god, that don't look right. Wangly flangly. I mean, actually, I might be wrong there. I want you to take Wedge back for me. I'm gonna look around for the others. He made it, didn't he? They could still be alive. I saw them both at the pillar. Jesse and Bates. I saw how bad they were hurt. I'm sorry, but... Don't. Don't say it. Ah, oh, damn it, she said it. They, they were supposed to return to us. Hmm. Stop now. They'll never let us live it down. So, we carry that weight. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Bet you gotta stop eating. <laughs> I won't be out to carry if you're getting heavier. <laughs> <laughs> I really don't do your summons that often. I do sometimes, but I don't use them that often, to be fair. I'm sorry. I truly am. We had no other place to go, and... I would never leave a wounded man out on the street. Elmira, I know what you said, but you have to let us go after Eric. Not this again. We found an underground Shinra lab, where they've done human testing. This wasn't the first time, and it won't be the last. I know these people, and I know they're never going to let Eric go. She's the last living ancient on the planet. Think about what that means to Shinra scientists. Especially to that son of a bitch, Hojo. We're all just numbers and meat Enough! to him. But... Please, I need some time to think. You really shouldn't be the one making decisions. Day. Why don't you go upstairs and get some rest? Oh, it's this. I think this is it. This is the thing where everything you've done up to this point reflects what you get here. I think we're going to get... I'm not sure. Should we go upstairs? So in the original, they just suddenly decide to go and do that. Go, go and get her. It's not even like a debate or anything like that. <laughs> oh god, sorry. Bit of a sneeze there. So, this is a lot of extra little bits. Wait, is there no one in there? Oh, wait, Marlene's in there. Wait, if Marlene's in there, where's Wedge? In our room? Is that picture on the wall? No, I don't remember that being a picture. The heck is that a picture of? Oh, there's a few pictures here. 
It's a cat. I don't know where they got a picture of a cat. They got a pet cat. I didn't know they had a pet cat. I didn't know Aerith had a pet cat. Oh, maybe not anymore. Ah. Oh, we got... We got Tifa! Okay, we got Tifa for this one. Okay, there are three you can get. You can get Tifa, you can get Aerith, and you can get Barrett. And again, it's every choice you've made up to this point that uh, adds to it. I think it's because we picked up Tifa first in the uh, series. Can't sleep. No. I believe that's the only choice that chooses you between can. Tifa and Aerith if you've done b all of Aerith their missions, good. which is uh, Sector Seven and Sector Sorry. Five. Didn't mean to wake you. The choices between them is literally I'm just which one you pick. It's a soldier thing. <sighs> uh, to get Barrett, on the other hand, you have to do no quests. <laughs> you have to do no quests, and then it doesn't matter who you pick. I knew there was something weird going on. You buying flowers. Also, if you get Aerith, it's Aerith, it's basically like a live stream ghost sort of thing, like a projection sort of thing. I was curious, so I looked it up. At least we th I think it is. I tried to keep it alive as long as I could. You can tend it's just gone. It's dead and buried. They all have their own story too. Our home? And everything else. <sighs> I should not have talked over that. <laughs> they took everything from us again. I actually haven't seen this scene before. It's stupid. I got Aerith last time I played. I know that crying's a waste of time. I think I got Aerith every time That's I played. Hmm. So I wasn't expecting her to get that emotional. Then they did the emotional bit earlier. I was not expecting that at all. <laughs> Had to go quiet for that. You've done more for us than we deserve. I won't forget this. If you ever need anything, all you gotta do is holler. Happy to help out, however I can. How are you gonna holler, Myra? I've been thinking about what you said. She's calling out to me. I can feel it. We all hmm. can. So please. She's our friend. We have to help her. Mm -hmm. I always knew it was coming. Knew that one day I'd have to say goodbye to my baby girl. But not yet. <clears throat> Please, bring her back to me. So oh there. <laughs> Kinda. We'll bring her Daddy. somewhere. Are you going? Them feeling like she's reaching out to them makes me feel like the one way you fight the Aerith is the canonical I'm one. Sorry, honey. I wish I didn't have to. I do kind of want the Tifa one to be I canonical, though. <laughs> all the time. I really do. Just because there's a they're so good together. Here, I can't fight out there. Some bad people are trying to hurt the planet. 
I mean, Barrett Bar Bar got his emotional moment, so Tifa needed back. hers. Get away. The slums, your friends, the whole planet. It's daddy's job to protect. Hmm? Well, you could get Barrett's one and make this chapter all about Barrett. <laughs> it does seem like it is all about Barrett. <laughs> Time for that one moment. And that's why I've got to go. Yeah, I had the pretty national breakdown. I had finally so find her. made sure his daughter was fine. And when we bring her home, you need to say thank you, okay? Barrett is the person you take control of in the underground. Yeah. And then this scene with Barrett. If you make Barrett, they're also the one you meet at night, too. <laughs> it's all about Barrett. You should help her. Maybe that one's canonical. <laughs> We're getting a lot of scenes back to back. Barrett. She's tougher than me. Alright. Time to get some payback. Don't forget why we're doing this. I know, I know. To rescue Aaron. So there it is. We supposed to get topside. Hold well on. Before we do the uh running. Well, we could walk along the tracks. The city's on high alert. All the roads and public transit. There we go. Pedometer. Right so what's the plan then? You know another way up? No, but I think I know someone who might. You mean Corneo? Yeah. That's where we're going. But, I'm going to show you what the pedometer is. Uh, we also need to equip Cloud because he has nothing. Uh, pedometer, current steps, zero, goal, thigh thousand. May do something after taking a number of steps with it. So you have to walk 5,000 steps to do whatever this does. You have to have it equipped while, while walking those steps. I might do this off screen in between this episode and the next. We'll see. Uh, or but doing the next episode or whatnot. Uh, I feel like it should, isn't something we should be carrying around this a lot. Anyway, thanks everyone so much for watching. And for now, we're done here. I'll see you in the next one. See ya. Oh, right. I should. There we go. Now I'll see you. Nice background.